Alrighty. Ryan fucking early. Me and this kid, I can't even tell you the amount of times that we got into some shit that does not need to be talked about. But what I do have to say is, this kid is my fucking brother. We have been through thick and thin. I've seen the goods and the bads. We've been through everything. And seeing him and Brittany together still since high school, when I got them to go out on their first date together, and I had to go and join with another date so they would go on a double date just to go out together. Yes, that was me. I was there. Credits approved right here. Thank you. She got the number, but I went on the date. We'll tip that out later, Abby. All right. Everybody raise a drink and cheers to them. Um, but I just want to say that I'm just so happy for the both of them <laughs> because I love them so much and Brian I'm so proud of you like as a dad and as a brother I feel like you just I don't know you're my younger brother but I feel like you're a role model I feel like you picked such a good partner and Brittany you're like literally goals for a mom like you're like super mom and I just love you so much so I don't know. Congrats to everybody. Congrats, you guys. I love you both so much. All I want to say is that I think that Ryan is probably one of the best sons anyone could ever have. <laughs> He's never disrespected me. He's never been rude to me. He has just been the biggest sweetheart, the hardest worker, just the best kid I could ever ask for as a son. So I love you, Ryan. Thank you so much for being so respectful. So I wish both of you the best, and I will always bear, be there for both of you. Um, there was a song I was thinking of, and I couldn't remember the hell of the name of it. Should I smoke too much pot outside? <laughs> Um, I've known Brittany my whole life. She is one of um, my very few girlfriends who has been around um, since we were kids. And oh my gosh, Brittany's parents and then our parents, like it, we were always like playing at each other's houses, day and the night, having these awesome sleepovers. And I am so lucky to have been able to share your friendship for all these years. And Britt, you've been an amazing friend. And you know, despite us growing up and taking you know different paths and all these things happening um, we've still managed to be best friends and I just want to say that I love you and <laughs> I love you and your family and yeah I'm very happy to be here cheers <laughs> this, uh, I kind of got a story of me Ryan and man, we will all wish that you'd be here today. I don't know, what, what we're about 10. We're sneaking chew out in the middle of the fucking lake. <laughs> we're different about, yeah, you know? It's good time, it's good time. <laughs> but some of those stories I will live with for fucking ever, and I love you guys more than ever. And I'm so proud of you and Brittany, and I look up to you. 
Love you guys. Welcome family, friends, and loved ones. We are gathered here today to celebrate the love of Ryan and Brittany. I am honored to unite them in marriage. A strong and lasting marriage is built on love, trust, and respect. But in my opinion, it is also built on laughter and a lot of it, cherishing each precious moment, supporting each other, and creating a life so wonderful that every single day is a blessing. Always be grateful for just being together and sharing your lives with one another. As you head into married life, remember to be the reason the other smiles. Be the reason they feel alive. And be the reason that every day they know they are loved. These rings have no beginning and no end. They set forth the eternal nature of real love. Remind yourselves daily of what brought you here together. From this day forward, you will walk hand in hand along the beautiful path of your marriage, united strong as husband and wife.